Hey everyone, James George with Web Design Blog, and this week I'm going to talk about the Polygon tool. If you've been working in Adobe Illustrator, you'll know that uh, when you use the uh, star shape tool in Illustrator, you can uh, determine the amount of uh, points that the star has, and so you can make it go down to three points to, to make your triangle, and that's, you know, that's a little tip, tip for Illustrator, but what about Photoshop? Well, you can make a uh, triangle uh, really easily inside of Photoshop if you use the polygon tool. So let's um, go into Photoshop here and you can see that um, your um, typically people have the, the two row toolbox and here right under the text tool you have rectangle, rounded rectangle, ellipse, polygon. So in the polygon up at the top you can see that you can dial in the number of sides. And so the default is five or six, which will give you a pentagon or a hexagon. But you can actually, uh, you can change the, the number of sides up here to three. And you can see it uh, draws out an equal lateral, equal lateral triangle. You can also align it to the hexagon as well. So it just really just depends on what you want to do, but you know, it comes in really handy. But I, Another way that you can determine the amount of sides uh, featured in your polygon is to just click the canvas without drawing. And so here you can actually determine the width in pixels, flints, pockets, whatever measurement you're using, and the number of sides and whether you have uh, smooth corners. And you can create a star, just like in Adobe Illustrator. So let's say you have five sides star indent sides by 53 percent let's say by 10 percent and we'll see what we get and um, smooth indents you know you can do you well i'll show you these effects here in a second but so you have five sides indent sides by and i'll, I'll just go ahead and bump this up because i'll show you some other stuff here in a second so 100 pixels wide 100 pixels tall five sides star indent sides by 40 percent and you have a star just like in adobe illustrator but you take this same tool and say 10 let's say 20 sides smooth corners smooth indents and then we'll say 10 percent and hit ok that's how you get the rounded sort of badge shape right inside of Photoshop in two seconds. A lot of people complain that you can't do the same things in Photoshop as you can in Illustrator, but that's not true. I do use both, and I think Illustrator is the best tool for creating custom shapes, but uh, you can do the same thing inside of Photoshop if you know where to look. That's it for this week. I'm James George. This is Web Design.